Hey up everybody, uh, I'm on part two of my riding car project or riding truck or riding trolley whatever you want to call it and I'm going to deal with the main frame today so in part one if you've not seen part one I did a complete overview of all the different components that make up the riding car and today then I'm just going to deal with this main frame I'm making it out of round tube instead of square tubing. Uh, it's 27 inch long, 8.5 inch wide. Uh, there's two long stretchers down the down each side, then two uh, a, a rear support, two middle supports, and a front support with a leg rest or foot rest will hang. Then coming off that frame, there'll be four suspension hangers, one in each corner. Two uh, brake hangers, one on each side, and two foot rest or leg rest support brackets that will be welded onto that square tubing. I'm going to weld two round tubing pieces on the back for the water carrier. If you're not going to put a water carrier on, you don't have to put those on. And then there'll be two small brackets welded onto the front hangers and four welded onto the rear hangers. That's to hold the front and the rear plates on. I've got everything cut to length now and, and pre-drilled and this is how it's going to fit. So I've cut, I've cut to the rear section at 45 degrees so it can be welded together the cut off square and on the front bit will fit the cross member that holds the, the that's going to hold the foot rest in that's going to be welded on to there the two angle brackets will be welded onto the foot rest at an angle to support the foot rest or the leg rest so that's one on each side. There's four suspension hangers pre-drilled for the uh, tie rod to go through and they'll be welded that, that'll be welded onto the underside if, it, if that explains it properly and then there's one of them in each corner The two brake hangers will be welded on the underside. The two cross member supports are the same tubing but I've squashed each end so that it'll, it'll be welded onto there like that equally spaced. This is going to be for the water carrier bracket to fit onto. I'm going to weld those in the corners on the rear. If you're not going to put one of those on, you don't have to. Obviously, you don't have to weld them brackets on. They'll be welded onto that there. Then I've got these six small angle brackets, which I've pre-drilled and tapped M6. So there's two for the front, four for the rear. And they're going to be welded onto the suspension brackets or suspension hangers like that to support the front plate. Now there's only two on the front because I'm going to utilise this tubing, this square tubing to, for the uh, top fixings and on the rear there's going to be two on each plate, one at the top and one at the bottom. To, if you've not got a welder or you can't weld, you could uh, adapt it to, to bolt it all together by just putting various brackets on I suppose, but I'm sure it could all be bolted together and it would, it would make it easier if you used uh, square tubing instead of round tubing if you're going to bolt it together.
I've got to weld these um, these plates on, which I've shown you in my drawing. One in each corner. They're going to support the suspension units. And I couldn't show you very well on bench when I was showing you how they fitted, but they fit on the underside uh, with the angle piece that's cut off that way. Like that. The rear is slightly different because you've not got this square tube on the back. They're going to fit the same way, facing the same way in the corner like that. Again I'll put a piece of bar in to line them up and I'll just show you in detail. So they're going to fit in the back corner flush with the top. I've clamped the brackets to the frame. I've put a piece of 3 8 bar in to keep the holes lined up. And I'm just going to tack these now, take the clamps off, make sure everything's aligned before I fully weld it. And what you've got to watch out for, you've got to make sure it's parallel to the frame, that way, and also looking from the top. So the back ones, they're going to come more or less flush with the top of the tubing. Right, on the front then I've just got the brake rod, the brake lever arms fixing arms to weld on, one on each side underneath like that and I'm going 10 inches from the front to that position and that's where the brake shaft pivot point will go through. So the front, the front square tubing where the footrests are going I'm measuring 10 inches or if you don't like imperial sizes 255 millimeter to the center of that bracket. Brake brackets now welded on I'm going to move on to the fixing uh, brackets for the front plate and the back plate two at the bottom because I'm going to utilise this square footrest material for the top fixing hole so there's two on the front plate and then on the bottom plate there'll be one at the bottom and one at the top on both sides that's these angles which I've shown you in the previous part going to weld them on there like that, one there and one there. Just one more thing to weld on now, well two more things. <coughs> the uh, front foot rest or leg rest brackets that come off at an angle. I've set my angle finder, it's at 100 and approximately 107 and a half degrees. That's not critical, it all depends on your, the raised track you'll be running on so it clears the tip over rails. So what I've done then, I've put a magnet on to hold it in position at that angle while I just tack it on. 
So that's the front of the riding car. And that's going to be the angle. So this angle here is 107 and I've set mine at 107 and a half degrees. That's the main riding car frame completed now. Uh, if you've not seen the drawings, take a look. Take a look back at I think it were in part one. Individual items now for the suspension unit, the wheels and the braking system. There's a couple of footrests to knock up. Move on to suspension units next then and uh, we'll take it from there and I'll do that in the next part. I'll sign off for now then. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next part. Bye for now then.